Because I wish my dad was here. Yeah. yeah it was well. probably one of my dad's dreams to do this. <laughs> Miss your dad, don't you? Yeah. Taxi firm owner Simon currently lives with his wife Louise and mum Carol in Suffolk. <laughs> Carol's dream was to enjoy her retirement with her husband, travelling the British Isles in style. But sadly, a year before their planned adventure, he passed away. Since my mum's retired and she lives with us, it's, it's, we've got a bucket list, really, and yours is a rather large bucket, isn't it, mum? It is. Being as though she's been a housewife for 60 years. Now, Simon wants to do whatever he can to give his mum the retirement she always dreamt of by building her her very own mobile holiday home from a giant old railway cattle carriage. I thought he meant a, a passenger railway carriage. I didn't know he meant um, one of those. And a I, cattle wagon. And I thought, how can that end up a motor on? I thought it was going to go on train tracks, didn't you? I didn't know where it would go, no. I thought, you <laughs> thought were... we were going to ride round on railways on, on holiday. <laughs> the insane level of ambition in this project is something most people would never even consider. But Simon isn't most people. And if he's got this build right, he could be about to make his mum's dream come true. Hand on heart, I can honestly say Simon's pulled it off in spectacular style. Good morning, sire. Morning, George. So good to see you, mate. I'll tell you what, she looks fantastic. Thanks. Standing as proud as its creator in the Suffolk countryside, this cattle carrier mobile home is truly a sight to behold. She's a tiny house, but she's not yeah. that tiny. Look at the vehicle she's sitting on. That's brilliant, that. It's go big or go home. Go big or go home. Yeah. It's took a lot of work, a lot of patience, because you remember from last time, I'm not one for using measurements. No, I am amazed you've done it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I, so many people are. Can we have a closer look? I'd love to show you around. Come on, then. The timber looks really smart, mate. You've done a good job. Yeah. It's really a, good a job. Large timber. The beauty of this material is you don't have to treat it, so there's no maintenance on it. Yeah, 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 no, that's brilliant. Some nice doors. Yeah, lovely, from Dover, them. Yeah, lovely, yeah. Second-handers? Yeah, all reclaimed. And yeah. that space is quite handy. What yeah. are you going to put in there? Batteries, 1,000-litre water tank. I'm pretty sure I'll be getting a camp bed in there and I'll be forced in there when they're snoring. Do you think? I do, yeah. I've been known to suck the curtains off the window when I go. <laughs> So has your mum seen it? She's seen little snippets of photographs that I've taken and been working on at home. But she hasn't seen us finished like this? No. You are genuinely nervous, I can tell. I am. Come on, come on. Hello, Mum. Hello. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine, thank so you. So nice to see you. You must nice be very you. excited. I am. Now, he's given a lot, hasn't he, to this he project? Yes, he has. An awful lot. An awful lot. Yeah. He's had to dye his hair and his beard. He has really? not. You're not, meant to yeah, tell not. You're not meant to tell people like that. <laughs> I was in your grey. I yeah. was, I was yeah. going that grey, George. People were asking me if I were doing the Santa in the local supermarket. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Should we go inside? Yeah. Do you want to see it? Yeah. Come on, Be let's looking go. forward to it. <laughs> After you, it's your palace. <laughs> right. <laughs> you all right? Yeah. When you get up there, hold on to the side. Yeah. What do you think? Oh, it's fab. Oh, it's lovely. The word motorhome doesn't come remotely close to doing this build justice. The level of finish in this characterful yet luxurious mobile holiday home is mind-blowing. Everywhere you look, you can see the care and love in every last detail. And Simon's done it all for his mum. Oh, it's great. Cosy. Cosy. <laughs> Favourite colour, purple, Mum. Yeah. From the striking vintage stained glass windows to the reclaimed white tongue and groove panelling, Simon's put thought into everything. When we first met, 
We talked about your mum possibly sleeping on the couch. Yeah. But you've built her a proper bed, haven't you? No couch for your no mum. No couch for my mum. She's too too old and too precious, aren't you? <laughs> you deserve a queen's uh -oh. bed. <laughs> Come on, let's have a look. Wow. That's all right, oh, eh? Yeah, that is beautiful. You took the word out of my mouth. Snug yet sumptuous, with pops of colour from the windows, this is a mezzanine fit for a queen. I can see out the window in the morning, can't I? I know, you've got a lovely view out that window yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me before. You know, I'm, I'm a, I do things for people. I don't, people don't do right, it's payback things time back then, for me. Anyone. Yeah. You literally have got a little list, haven't you, yeah, of places yeah, that you yeah. really, really like want to go and see. see. My cousin, who went for 30 years to Cornwall, every year said, you must go to Cornwall, but... I'm yeah. taking you, Mum. Right. Them days, you didn't go on them kind of holidays, uh, unless you had plenty of money in that. You've, uh, yeah. you've put a little tear in your Mum's eye. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Good. Yeah. It's lovely. Thanks. Say it again. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking Say forward. It. I'm looking. Say it slow and loud. Thank you. Welcome. Thanks, love. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, Carol won't be staying here on her own. So how'd you get up to your bed? Staircase comes down. That staircase. There, yeah. In the ceiling. In the ceiling. Come on and do it. Wow. And it just drops. Really into nice. position. Yeah. He's good, isn't he? <laughs> Up those gorgeous handcrafted stairs, Simon and his wife's first floor bedroom has rustic scaff board flooring and wide reclaimed windows. And downstairs in the bathroom, there's a striking herringbone brick floor accented with colourful second-hand Italian tiles. But what's truly unique is that Japanese-style bath made from an old whiskey barrel. I'm loving that tub. Yeah. I'll get you a little step to get in it. Oh, yeah. Now I'm doubt. sitting there like a bobbin <laughs> apple. All day. Yeah. Won't you? Yeah. This project was always so much more than an amazing space as built. It's been a true labour of love. But other than the months of sleepless nights and extra hair dye, at what cost? Now, your original budget was yeah. how much? We said about 18, didn't we? So what have you spent in the end? 23, 24. 23, 24 grand. So that's yeah. five to six thousand pounds of yeah. your original budget. Yeah. There were just unforeseen things that you don't know about. Money you can make, it's time you can't get back. And I think it's time is more precious for us, mm -hmm. isn't it, Mum, to yeah. get on that road and yeah, start yeah. getting out there, you know? Because I wish my dad was here. Yeah. yeah it was probably one of my dad's dreams to do this. <laughs> Miss your dad, don't you? Yeah. Good lad. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's it. He always wanted a motor on. Yeah, always. Yes. Wipe yeah. the tears and fill it with laughter. <laughs> yeah. <don't>? <laughs> <laughs> a mother's love, George, <laughs> and support. <laughs> the best in the world. Well, enjoy the first road trip together. We will. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Love every single second of it. Mm -hmm. Really, really well done. Take care. Yeah. Keep looking after her. I will. I will. Good. <laughs> Good. Take care. Bye bye. 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 I have to say, I am completely blown away by this project. It's incredible. And it just goes to prove that you don't need a degree in architecture or be trained as a master craftsman to create a very beautiful, amazing space. But what you do need is hard work, passion, commitment, and you also need to throw in a little sprinkling of love. Simon wanted to build something really special to thank his mum for everything that she's done in his life. And you know what? He's done it.